Sterling pull it out. Trying to regroup here. Torre driving inside, under the basket, and good. Looks like a foul going to be called on Grace Hudson as well. This is well. Absolutely. Uh, VCU read over that scout report very, very well, and they are really taking JMU's game away from them. Tibiasu blocked on her way to the basket. It's out of bounds. On the rebound. Kiki Jefferson kicks it out. McDaniel makes the three. On leading scorer so far tonight for the Dukes with five points, but she hasn't scored since the first quarter. Jefferson down low looking for a teammate. Beautiful, Beautiful feed pass. to Torre, and Torre now with five points. Easy with six points for VCU. Jefferson gets a screen. Now she'll be able to drive to the basket. She's fouled and gets the two points on top of it. Oderkirk double teamed. Finds a wide open Germond. Too strong. Oderkirk with the rebound, though. Turnaround jumper is good. And they whistle, and a foul will be called. Makes both. Five points for Janika Griffith-Wallace. Again, she came to VCU courtesy of Murray State. Did play for the Rams last season. Was a key contributor defensively, really, for VCU. And now that shot will fall, and it will count. Offensive continuity, and maybe Hudson give, give them the lift that they need. Grace Hudson checks back into this game now for VCU. Jefferson pulls up for three. That's good, and Kiki Jefferson starting to heat up. But VCU does get a shot off, at least, here in the second half. German, Jefferson, Oderkirk. Open three. Good. Sit down. Her first points of the game, timeout VCU as JMU takes their first lead since early in the ball game. Pull up. Excuse me, one dribble spin back, and it's, it's been very effective tonight. Neff over to Sterling, wants to take a three from the wing, and it is good. Nothing but nylon for the freshman from Kennesaw, Georgia. And somebody's open. It's Torre this time for three. Too strong. McDaniel gets a rebound. And JMU getting multiple opportunities here. Sterling pays off. Third time's the charm for JMU. Especially if she can get a screen and get open. That's what they're trying to do. She's going to drive to the basket and gets the tough shot to go down. And that will be the end of the third quarter. It's 47-46 JMU. A one-point advantage going into the final quarter here at the Siegel Center. Jefferson being double teamed. Kicks it out to German for three. That one is good. Tibiasu kicks it out to Janika Griffin Wallace, who's going baseline. Feeds it to Asari. Shot is up. Offensive foul is called. The shot won't count.